When a girl says she hates you, can it mean something else? When a girl tells you she hates you, it can be incredibly painful. After all, those words carry a heavy weight, and they can leave you feeling confused, rejected, and hurt. But is it possible that when a girl says she hates you, it might not mean what it appears to? Could there be a deeper layer of emotion, a hidden message behind her words? In this article, we'll explore the psychology behind such a statement and uncover some surprising truths that may change your perspective. Let's dive in and find out what might be going on when a girl says she hates you. 1. She's actually hurt or upset. It's easy to assume that when someone says they hate you, it's because they truly do. However, emotions are often more complex than that. A girl may say she hates you because she's hurt, frustrated, or angry about something you've done. In some cases, she might be using strong words to express her disappointment or dissatisfaction. When people feel emotionally wounded, they sometimes react in extreme ways. Instead of calmly discussing the issue, they lash out with hurtful words like, I hate you, as a defense mechanism. This statement is often a cover-up for deeper emotions, such as sadness, jealousy, or frustration. It could also indicate that she feels neglected, misunderstood, or betrayed in some way. What to do? If you suspect this is the case, try to approach the situation with empathy. Give her some time and space to cool off, and when she's ready, ask her to explain what's bothering her. Listening to her feelings can help clear the air, and may even bring you closer. 2. She might be playing hard to get. Believe it or not, some girls use the phrase, I hate you, as a way to play hard to get. This tactic is often used when a girl feels unsure about her feelings for you, or wants to see how much effort you're willing to put into the relationship. It's a test to see if you'll pursue her despite her harsh words. This behavior can be particularly common in situations where there's an attraction, but the girl is hesitant to admit it or act on it. She may use, I hate you, as a shield to protect herself from vulnerability. It's her way of seeing if you'll still chase after her, even when she pushes you away. What to do? If you think she's playing hard to get, stay confident but don't chase her too aggressively. Instead, let her know that you're interested in her, but be careful not to pressure her. It's about striking a balance between showing your interest and respecting her boundaries. 3. She's jealous or insecure. Jealousy is a powerful emotion, and it can often manifest in negative ways. A girl who feels insecure about her relationship with you might lash out with statements like, I hate you, especially if she's worried about your interactions with other girls. This kind of behavior can be rooted in fear of losing you or a lack of trust. If she's jealous, it's not necessarily a sign that she doesn't care about you, it could indicate that she does care but feels threatened or unimportant in some way. Jealousy often stems from a desire for attention and affection. So when a girl expresses this kind of emotion, it might be her way of asking for reassurance. What to do? If you notice signs of jealousy or insecurity, take the time to reassure her. Let her know that she's important to you and that your relationship is something you value. Addressing her feelings and offering validation can go a long way in helping to dissolve her negative emotions. 4. She's feeling overwhelmed or stressed. Sometimes, external pressures can contribute to negative feelings and outbursts. If a girl says she hates you, it could be because she's overwhelmed by stress from other areas of her life. Whether it's school, work, family issues, or personal struggles, these external factors can make her feel emotionally drained and irritable. As a result, she might project her frustration onto you, even if it's not your fault. In these cases, her words might have nothing to do with you at all. She might be using you as an emotional outlet for the stress she's dealing with. It's important to recognize that her I hate you could be a temporary reaction to her emotions. What to do? If you suspect she's stressed or overwhelmed, offer your support and understanding. Be there for her when she's ready to talk, but avoid pushing her to open up if she's not ready. 
Sometimes, the best way to help is by simply giving her space to process her emotions. 5. She's afraid of getting hurt. Fear of getting hurt or rejected is something that everyone can relate to. If a girl says she hates you, it could be because she's afraid of opening up and being vulnerable. It's easier for her to put up a defensive wall and say something harsh like, I hate you, rather than admit she has feelings for you or is afraid of being hurt. This often happens when someone has been hurt in the past and is afraid to go through the same emotional pain again. By pushing you away with harsh words, she's trying to protect herself from getting too close and potentially experiencing rejection. What to do? If you think fear is at the root of her words, approach her with patience and understanding. Give her time to trust you and avoid rushing her into a relationship. Reassure her that you respect her feelings and are willing to take things slow. 6. She's trying to get your attention. In some cases, a girl might say she hates you because she's actually trying to get your attention. This can happen if she likes you but isn't sure how to express it. By making an extreme statement like, I hate you, she's trying to get a reaction from you, hoping you'll prove that you care. It's a form of indirect communication that some people use when they want to test the waters or gauge your interest. This behavior is often seen in younger individuals or those who haven't yet mastered the art of open communication in relationships. It's her way of seeking validation and figuring out how you feel. What to do? If you think she's trying to get your attention, stay calm and show her that you're interested in getting to know her better. Be patient and offer a genuine response that shows you care, but without being too forceful. Over time, this can help her feel more comfortable expressing her true feelings. 7. She's just venting. Finally, sometimes people say things they don't mean simply because they're venting. A girl might be feeling frustrated, angry, or hurt by something else entirely, and in the heat of the moment, she directs that anger at you. In these cases, her words are more about her emotions than anything you've done wrong. It's important to recognize that venting isn't always rational, and what's said in a moment of frustration doesn't always reflect someone's true feelings. What to do? If she's venting, try to stay calm and avoid reacting defensively. Give her space to express her emotions, and let her know that you understand she's upset. Once she's calmed down, you can talk about the situation and clear the air. Conclusion. When a girl says she hates you, it doesn't always mean what you think it does. There are many underlying reasons why she might express herself this way, and it's important to consider the context of her words. Whether she's hurt, jealous, afraid, or just venting, her emotions are complex, and understanding them can help you navigate the situation more effectively. If you find yourself in this situation, take a step back, stay calm, and try to empathize with her feelings. With patience and understanding, you may be able to uncover the true cause of her words and work toward resolving any issues. After all, communication and empathy are key to any successful relationship. If you enjoyed watching this video, don't forget to like subscribe and turn on the notification bell, so you don't miss any new videos. Let us know your thoughts about this video in the comment section down below, and feel free to stay and enjoy it until the end. Also make sure to check out our next highlighted video, and we will see you next time. Thanks for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe.